Hi, I'm uh, Nick Moncur, the head pro at Ingribon Links Golf Complex in Rainham, Essex. And um, last week we had we had Simon Khan actually down in the coaching studio. Um, and I just want to analyse his swing for you. Um, Simon's a very tall man, uh, six foot two or three. Um, doesn't swing upright like most tall players. Likes his likes his arms close to his body. Likes the link between body and arms. And you see there with a the setup. His, his arms in very, very close to him, un, right under his chest there. Um, so already linked up nicely. He's, he's hitting seven irons here. I mean, a lot of, lot of tour players like to um, see their approach shots with a, with a little bit of fade on them, just so they can control the distance and the spin a lot, lot easier. Don't want their approach shots going in drawing, as it's much harder to control. So he set, set up the seven iron here. And you can see in, in his takeaway, Arms very close to the body there, nice and linked. Club parallel with the left arm, very good position. What most tall players like to get into. Nicely on plane. And hinges the uh, the wrist nicely. So although he keeps you know, his arms quite flat for a tall man, quite, quite close to his body, he doesn't get the club flat. He, he, he hinges the wrist nicely there. Club's, club's plane is, is excellent. And that puts it at the top there, nicely on plane. See his left arm there across his across his shoulder line. Um, right elbow tuck. So not really high swinger like a like a Dustin Johnson, someone else sort of his height. He, he swings compact and neat there on on that position. You can see the club slightly laid off there at the top as well. A lot of lot of tour players you'll see that these days like it a little bit more laid off and controlled at the top. Don't want it. Um, too long or especially across the line causes problems on the way down and timing issues. So you can see from that position he can just pull his arms down, start to shift his body weight. You see coming into impact, gets his left arm back in close to him under that line just before impact. Uh, good body position. Uh, Simon's never been a big hip turn person, never, never been one to really turn the hips Oh, I'd like, like to um, keep his hips quiet and control the shot, but a little more feel. You can see the arms close there, exits left. So the ball starts a little left, and, and we'll, we'll just fade back about five yards that shot. So very controlled, great, great approach shot. Um, you can see face on. I'll just highlight Simon's head position here. Again, the compact swing, you can see the arms close to the body, what we've just seen, and the head stays really, really still with, with Simon, really doesn't shift a lot of weight there, keeps it compact and neat. Just got enough shoulder turn, about a, a you know a 90 degree turn there to control it. See then the weight shift, head goes a little bit forward because the weight's getting onto the left side. And then nice and still there, so his head's staying nicely into that circle, right down through into impact. I say quite hip action, nice balance, likes to control his shots up to a very nice finish all the time, really works hard on his balance and holds that finish for a few seconds after every shot. Um, so it's a, it's a great swing, it's a pleasure to have Simon down in the coaching studio and um, hope we see him again soon. Thanks Simon.